Assalamu alaikum. I am Muhammad Azim Jinnit from Pakistan and this is my very first tutorial in English. In this tutorial I will show you how to make simple curtains very easily in Marvelous Designer, a software for 3D clothing. We can make curtains in 3D Studio Max, Maya and other 3D software but Marvelous Designer has such options that we can create 3D clothing very quickly, very easily and very realistic. Ok, let's start. I am using Marvelous Designer 3 or MD3 but you can follow me easily with any other version of the software. When we open the software, we will get this 3D window with default avatar, a model which may be a human being or not and clothes which are called patterns in MD or Marvelous Designer. Because we need here a simple curtain, we have to remove this model and clothes or fabric or pattern from the environment, 3D environment and 2D pattern side. For this, first go to avatar and then click on show avatar to save the modesty of the model and then go to garment and click on show garment and there is no garment and model in 3D environment or 3D preview window. To clear the 2D window or pattern view, uh, pattern window, we can remove these clothes or their patterns simply by select with left mouse uh, simple uh, dragging with left mouse button and uh, press delete button from keyboard or click here when this uh, anywhere in this window when this window is selected you can see that a red outline border form is appearing control a is the short key to select all and hit the delete button from the keyboard and there is no pattern in our 2D window or 2D preview now. To start our simple curtain we have to add a rectangular shape. For that go to tools here at the top and is a gray rectangular create rectangle s is the short key click on that and with left mouse button just drag to create the basic shape of our curtain now second tool transform pattern click it and with this we can select the buttons of the transform options and we can change easily simply by dragging the sides accordingly through these buttons and we can change the size of our basic curtain and now we have to press synchronize button Here it is, two arrows, click it and when we press it, we will show the preview of our pattern in 3D window. It's a 3D preview, we can zoom in, zoom out, zoom out and we can rotate it, short keys are available 
just like all other software go to setting preference and there in view control session on the top right side you have presets user preset default preset maya 3 max and some other you can change the short keys whatever you like and make your work easy and another thing that go to environment gizmo and uh, select word coordinate gizmo to move or rotate your patterns in 3d window properly okay now this is the main part of our curtain um, on which we have to create waves or creases and that is the easiest part in marvelous designer as you already said and you will see that within couple of seconds we will get very realistic effect of 3d curtain in very less time okay here is the main part of our curtain and we have to create another part at the top once again go to create rectangle uh, create rectangle tool and with left mouse button just make a rectangle shape but it should be less in the main part it should be less in length ok now just one thing and our curtain will be ready two steps only number one we have to sew the bottom edge of the upper part with the upper edge of the bigger one for that go to segment swing n is the short key click segment swing just drag and drop its upper part on its lower or its lower part on it, its upper it doesn't matter just click there if it doesn't apply ok here in 3d window as we have already pressed synchronize button we can see here the swing lines in 3d preview it means and the direction is correct it means that we have applied swing option on our fabric to join both parts correctly now just one step and the curtain is ready here is the final movement simulate button space bar is the short key just press it and curtain will be ready but stop it here we have to stop the curtain to move forward uh, move downward on the floor completely because we do not want to get that shape we have to get curtain for our room in any 3d software go to rearrange all patterns and the patterns are rearranged in 3d preview window click on upper small triangle right click and freeze it now it will not move downwards now press similar button and see what's happen
so as you can see what a quick and easy method with so realistic effect in the software if you want to add more waves or creases here just select tra transform pattern select the smaller one rectangular and just shorten it and you can see here in 3d preview window that result is there okay here is the curtain we have already prepared in marvelous designer very easily very quickly very natural okay but i want to add here some part of the curtain on the floor for that stop simulation click on upper part of the curtain which is smaller one rectangular and move it down a bit then press simulate button oh, floor is already there stop it again select it already selected and a um, little bit move down again to add more cloth on the floor and then simulate again okay here it is our simple form curtain a 3d curtain simple form 3d curtain for our 3d software 3d environment our scene we have create very quickly and very easily in marvelous designer when you satisfied stop simulation go to file export and obj save it as obj and use it in your pretty software which will discussed properly and thoroughly in the project at the end of creation all the objects we will make in marvelous designer one by one step by step till then see you goodbye